you want something wiser than that, then you can purchase this book. Isip ko, if I can read books na ganun kakapal, then what more pa kaya yung mga ganito thousands, thousands of books out there dun sa loob ng bookstore sa sulok na hindi masyado napapansin but can actually give more value to Welcome back to my channel. I'm wishing you everyone an advanced Merry Christmas and I hope that despite the problems, despite the negativity, we'll still be able to celebrate Christmas in a meaningful way. And as we all know, it's the season of giving and receiving and I think that one of the best gifts that we can give to ourselves is a book. So in this video, I'm going to make a review for this book, The ABCs of Success. The Essential Principles from America's Greatest Prosperity Teacher by Bob Proctor. And Bob Proctor is one of the most um, popular, one of the best motivational speakers in US. And na discover ko siya through YouTube. And it's my first time to actually purchase a book from him. Sulit naman siya, so I think that okay talaga ang libro instead of like, you know, wasting your time in social media like on Facebook or Instagram. Then talagang it's not a waste of time to read. Uh, something like this and before we dive into this don't forget to subscribe to my channel click the like button later on if you like the video and to click the notification button to be updated with my future videos so let's start first of all wala akong issue when it comes to reading kasi of course when we were younger especially nung elementary tsaka high school we were like bombarded with requirements na kailangan nating basahin to and then we have to make an essay, di ba? And then when it came to college, uh, we were required to read like ganito kakapal na books like for example, medical surgical nursing, um, maternal and child nursing, fundamentals of nursing, and so many more. And kung iisipin mo, sobrang nakakatuyo ng utak, hindi mo gusto yung topic, di ba? Parang you just have to read it, you're forced to read it kasi if not, you're going to fail. So naisip ko, if I can read books na ganun kakapal then what more pa kaya yung mga ganito na parang interested ako it doesn't really have to be non-fiction it can be fiction so anything na parang talagang interested ka sobrang may isip mo na parang if you're able to like parang read something like that na parang sobrang sakit sa ulo nakaka nosebleed then kayang kaya mo rin to so yun um, the goal of this book is actually like give you that motivation like it really talks about different areas of your life and he gave some tips on how you will be able to prosper sa yun nga sa iba't ibang area ng buhay mo and he divided it through chapters na each chapter is, is corresponding to one letter for example kasi kumaga a to z nga but <laughs> hindi siya a to z actually hanggang w lang siya so for example each letter merong idea for example to opportunity yan opportunity and then ito yung title the ito yung title and then yung parang main gist or minsan parang he starts with a quote eh, na galing din yata sa kanya and then ito yung parang meet, pinaka main kumaga pinaka meat ng kanyang uh, topic and then he closes it with a quote then from a popular person or from a successful person so yun opportunity ay iba ibang topic like goals positive beliefs faith and belief dreams the safety net syndrome, ano ba to? So, ang dami, ang dami mga topic na hindi lang siya specific sa isang area. So, it's not just about money, it's not just about building parang, yung parang self-esteem or self-worth. So, iba't ibang area nga. And there's really nothing profound dito sa book. Parang it's just some sort of like reminder for all of us. So, hindi siya yung parang out of this world na parang yeah, you have to do this and that na parang mapapatanong ka parang is this possible sa buhay ko parang ganun pero dito sobrang practical sobrang you can use it and yun nga parang ikaw yung tipong parang nawawalan ka na ng direction sa buhay mo and you need some guidance and maybe you're fed up with YouTube or something wala kang mahanap doon or like you're asking for advice from friends na parang feeling mo parang you want some more value or parang you want something na mas wise you want something wiser than that then you can purchase this book yun marami ako hinighlight eh ayun hindi ko ikaw yung tipong tamad magbasa 
Kung ikaw yung tipong gusto mo ma-motivate pero sobrang tamad ka nga, mag ayaw mo magbasa ng sobrang kakapal na libro, ito yun. Kasi parang it gives you that kind of parang, alam mo yun, it gives you that feeling na parang layo na agad ng nababasa mo. Kasi nga maikli lang naman siya. Ilang pages ba to? Um, two, wala pang tuwa. 204. 204 to be exact. And natapos ko siya for uh, two to three weeks lang. Actually, kayang-kaya mo to within a week eh. Kasi maikli lang naman siya. Maikli lang siya. Hindi siya nakakatamad ba sa ahin. Sulit siya. I mean, maraming books sa bookstore na naka-display na I think hindi naman din ganun ka-valuable. It's just that popular yung author and they were able to market it well. But I think that there are thousands of thousands of books out there dun sa loob ng bookstore sa sulok na hindi masyado napapansin but can actually give more value to you na mas marami kang natututunan and you know this is one of those books na marirecommend ko na I think na hindi ganun ka parang kaingay but sulit talaga siya so yun and I keep on buying these kinds of books kasi ako kasi for me like Ang pagbabasa, it's not something that is boring. For me, na introvert, I really recharge by, you know, spending me time. Kasi I have this tendency then to, like, spread myself to sin. And sometimes, I just really need my life back. I want my life back. So, and one of the ways I replenish is by reading a book. So, maybe you have a question na parang, do I prefer ebooks or... Uh, do I oh naglalabo so do I prefer ebooks or traditional books for me kasi ang maganda sa ebook like you can read it kahit nasa train ka diba nasa metro ka pwede mong basahin ganun so parang nagbabrowse ka lang din and madali siyang i-access pag nandito lang siya so anytime you can just open it pero kasi sabi nila sabi sa research meron daw tayong some sort of like spatial navigability niche special like spatial like pertaining to space na parang we have this tendency doubt as you must parang we have this parang tendency tama ba tendency we have this parang we want to know exactly where we are what is our location where we are so unlike sa book like pag sa book sa traditional book compared dito mas meron tayong spatial navigability dito kasi we know exactly where we are like we can put a bookmark we can highlight like Okay, nandito na ako sa page 38, so you can just bookmark it and then ibalik mo lang siya and the next time pwede mo siyang ulit basahin. But sa ebook, you can't make a bookmark, parang ganun. May pages din, but you know, mas okay daw sa book kasi parang you know very well na kung nasan ka, kung nasa start ka, nasa middle. Or, tawag na, na-fulfill niya yung need ng spatial navigability na yun. So bago yun, bago ko lang siya nalaman, siguro parang within this year lang. Ayan. Kasi one time ginugil ko parang what's the different, what are the advantages of traditional books over ebooks? And dun ko na, dun ko nalaman yun yung spatial navigability. So I don't know kung narinig niyo na rin yun. Yun. And that's it. I hope that you like the video. I think that if there is one thing that you need to do is really to motivate yourself. Sabi nga ni Zig Ziglar, parang motivation is not permanent and so is bathing. Kung baga, hindi ka, kailangan mo maligo every day, di ba? Kung baga, hindi yung porket naligo ka na last week, that's it, di ba? You have to really take a bath every day. And I think that motivation is like that, na parang you got motivated last week and that's enough. So you really have to like motivate yourself like as much as possible every day. And it's easier said than done, but if there are things that you really need to do, like you really have to be, you really have to be proactive to get yourself moving, to get yourself started. And uh, one of the books is, one of the ways to do that is by reading a good book, a uh, self-help book actually particularly. And yun, I hope that you like the video. And yun nga, don't forget to subscribe and to like it. And of course, don't forget to purchase my book at National Bookstore sa Metro Manila. Ayun, smile across the miles. And take care everyone. Um, Merry Christmas again. Advance Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. So, bye-bye. God bless.